Amazon S3 or simple storage service is a highly available object storage service that can store and retrieve any amount of data for virtually any use case, such as data lakes and cloud native applications. Hi guys, this is Abhi. And in this video, you're going to learn nine things about Amazon S3 in AWS. Let's get into it. Number one, since Amazon S3 is highly available and you only pay for what you use, you can start small and grow your application with no compromise on performance or reliability. Number two, the total volume of data and number of objects you can store in S3 is unlimited. However, individual S3 objects can range in size from a minimum of zero bytes to a maximum of five terabytes. Number three, for objects larger than 100 MB, you should consider using the multi-part upload functionality to improve throughput. Number four, Amazon S3 offers a range of storage classes that you can choose from based on the data access, resiliency, and cost requirements of your workloads. The storage classes include S3 intelligent tiering for automatic cost savings for data with changing access patterns, and S3 standard for frequently accessed data. Number five, S3 offers strong read after write consistency automatically without changes to performance and at no extra cost. Number six, Amazon S3 is available in AWS regions worldwide, and you can use S3 regardless of your location. You just have to decide which AWS region you want to store your S3 data in. Number seven, you can use the S3 event notifications feature to receive alerts when certain events happen in your S3 bucket, such as put, post, and delete events. Number eight, the S3 service level agreement provides a service credit if your monthly uptime percentage is below Amazon's service commitment in any billing cycle. Last but not the least, number nine. As of this recording, you get five gigs of S3 standard storage for free for 12 months with the AWS free tier. In summary, Amazon S3 allows you to easily manage data at any scale with cost-effective storage classes, robust access controls, and flexible replication tools. There you have it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time.